Hey, Rich Nation, AJ Rich here, and today we are going to be watching Attack on Titan. We're in part two of episode 14. Uh, last time was just kind of uh, them building up to go to Wall Maria, getting to Wall Maria, and uh, everything just going to shit really quickly. Nobody's there, and everything's suspicious, so I was just waiting for that moment for Reiner or uh, somebody to show up. Reiner shows up, stabs, and then the entire uh, Beast Titan and all them are there. Um, appears out of nowhere. It's just been a complete like ruining, and they they got baited. It's a big big old bait. They got baited. Um, but Erwin has gone in really thinking like, uh, yeah, he's gonna he's going to he's there to end this. He's there to end this. We already know his mentality. He's missing an arm. He's like he didn't want to just sit in a cushy area and not go anywhere. Obviously, he's will. I already know he's willing to freaking sacrifice everything. He's full in. So humanity or Titans, that's what's on his mind, and that's where we're at. Also, I want to note like the way I uh I the way how shaky like Aaron is worries the hell out of me, especially since we saw you know the end of part one, the end credit scene. Like it, he looked like some, he did something. So what, like, does it have to do with this? Like, indecis. He just feels indecisive to me. That's what what I'm getting from this. Like, like the way he's just been shaken since he learned everything. When he had no knowledge, and you know, and he's just like, I just need to save humanity. I need to defeat the Titans. He's 100% positive, never stopping. That's how he saved Armin, uh, you know, and gave up it. Well, thought he gave up his life. And, you know, another, we got baited as the audience and, <laughs> and he wasn't actually dead. But, um, yeah, he, he, uh, was full on ahead. But now that he knows everything, he's like, he's just shaken and, uh, indecisive. He doesn't know what he can do. It's like, I, I don't know. It's uh, he does, but he doesn't. It's like, but a lot of this plan has to do with him, him being able to, you know, go, you know, uh, use his uh, Titan ability and be able to block all the walls off and stuff. But now it doesn't even freaking matter with all them there, like with the Beast Titan and all that. So anyway, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe, smash that like button. Uh, go follow me on Twitter at uh, AJ Rich one, two, three, as well as check out my Patreon at patreon.com slash AJ Rich one, two, three for full reactions and early releases. And let's go ahead and start oh man they're all there all set up I, it's a standoff good old-fashioned standoff <laughs> oh shit it's hard all this hardening has he hardened before like that is that new for it seems like that's new for him it's like an army <laughs> the hell is on the what the hell yeah that's it a... An intelligent titan. Oh, wait, are these? I mean, there's every type of titan here, right? So could there be more like Reiner and Berthold too here? They're strategic as hell. <laughs> Look at that drawing. <laughs> oh, you, they can make him starve. They've organized. They've really organized all them. It's like they've been planning this for a while. That would be almost a checkmate at that point. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Levi. <laughs> Even in the face of danger, you get to be a dick. <laughs> I mean, if this doesn't work, these are the best people. Oh. Oh. 
Yeah, he's probably him or Mikasa would be the best for that. What are those guys? Are those twins? What the hell? あの馬を殺してここから離れる。それだけでいい。危なかった。あの時意識を全身に移すのが一瞬でも遅れていれば、あのまま即死だった。しかしなんだって壁の中なんて調べ。Oh, so they weren't expecting that. Okay. Yeah, they probably didn't think he He didn't they would think that far ahead. Even though we know some stuff, they're still mysterious too. For like half a season, we haven't learned any new information. I like how they're going with his perspective, though. Of course. Yeah, why put him in the main? Uh, it's gotta be some strategy that Erwin has. Yeah. What is its full power, though? We've seen him be able to call Titans, so. They're trying to save the horses, yeah. Oh, so that's his main. That was his main strat. We knew he was trying to save the horses, but now we know how. I th well, they can save each other if they, you know, they can run away or get away if they have to. They the horses are important, but they can't. He can't be taken as well, though. So he must have trust in him. It's in theory that's a good strategy. In theory. But now we know Reiner can think. Like Reiner's thinking. It was. It's interesting. まだどこかに潜んでいます。前回エレンはライナーをあと一歩のところまで追い詰めましたが。Yeah. Yeah. So everyone can perfect hardening the way he's the way he was talking. God damn. Oh, that's bad spots. God. Wait, so they're by they're by the house right now? They're by his house? Well. He's talking about the entire area. <laughs> this is more like Aaron. Good. Yeah, that's more like Aaron. It's good to see him be a little bit more. Yeah, like I said, more him, <laughs> more like less, like more confident, le less hesitant. Uh, Thunder Spears, a weapon developed to combat the stout defense of the armored Titan using technology formerly kept secret by the interior police. Though challenging to wield, it can deliver a concentrated blow comparable to a strike of lightning. Okay, so these are, yeah, the, no wonder they, they specifically made these to fight that. That's very... Okay, that's very strategic. Now, the big thing is, if you've never used them against that, you're not going to know if 100% if it's going to work. So that's going to be uh, interesting to see if it works or not. Hmm. <laughs> I never get used to how they look. <laughs> I mean, there are, a lot of them are new, though. Yeah. They're really weakened. You push through. I'm guessing they probably didn't believe him back then. Hmm. Hmm. Nobody else had a dream. He had a dream, but they didn't. He was lying to himself. Jesus. God. I mean, that'll fuck you up, really. He really needs... He needs to see it. 
世界の真相に God damn! 実験の会があった Yeah, he was training and all that. God damn. Can he regenerate it? It looks like he can't regenerate it that fast. Ugh. Let his guard down for a second. Damn. There goes the house. God! The pure force of his punches are crazy. Now they can do stuff as well to it. So it's not just on Eren, right? By using those? Yeah, so they can all. Yeah, okay. That's perfect. They can all do something. Uh. What? Wait, it did it did that? God damn! Like a rocket launcher. Well, they can back up Aaron with that then. I'm guessing they have that strategized. God. I mean they're pretty it's been mostly evenly matched. But this might help. Hmm? That? I never like when an anime character says that, or anyone says, we have this or that in quotes. It's always something bad. <laughs> this is great to have the other perspective, though. Like the enemy's perspective. Ooh! <laughs> Shit right in the eyes! A little poke in the eyes. That's all. A little poke. Oh, you can hurt yourself? Holy shit. I mean, you could really kill yourself. That's not good. You gotta be careful. Uh, any... Oh, there. You can't look at him that way anymore. It's funny John being the one to do that too. <laughs> Inspiring. God. Uh. Oh shit. Um. God damn. Talk about overkill. You're not gonna send one. You're not gonna send two. All at like, what, 20 of them? 15, 20 of them all at once? And it's weird to see Reiner say wait. What was he saying wait about? He said, uh, you know, or I'll have to use that or this. What was, I was waiting for him to do something right when that was happening, but he didn't do anything. But I have to, like, the way I look at it, I don't, anyone that has Titan abilities, I try not to think that they can, like, it just seems like almost impossible. Now, Annie did get beat, but she just, you know, hardened or whatever. So it's not like they're unbeatable. They can pass out and stuff. But what? Um, <laughs> getting through that, though, I just I I'm surprised that technology exists like that was very surprising because that that is a big night and day compared to the other uh technology or anything that they were using to uh to attack titans not just the armor titan they now the downsides of it would make it hard to really use on regular titans obviously they have to be in a certain situation as we saw but really that's it's just over that was just massive overkill now what is gonna happen after that i don't know um it was another cool thing in this episode that reiner 
we hear Reiner's perspective, which is new. It's new to, to hear like they're attacking. We know, we always know what the scouts are doing. We all, we always know like what Aaron's thoughts are, where everyone else's thoughts are, but not the other side. Even though Reiner was technically a scout, he is an enemy right now. He's a Titan. He's an enemy. Uh, but we're hearing the other side while it's happening. I, I just, I know it's a, it's something small, but it just in a, um, in a story and in a overall story and in a written like um perspective it's really kind of uh unique in a way to hear both sides and i i like that i like the narrative here um kind of knowing you know seeing what he's thinking because we've like i said in the beginning of season three we got none of them really so uh we don't really know we only know bits and pieces of what's been going on and he, you know i'm hiding in the walls that what's we don't know their full strategy <clears throat> But we know from the end of season two that, you know, uh, the coordinate being Aaron is bad. As he said, it's bad. He doesn't. Um, he also says that it's not. He do, Aaron doesn't know. Um, he hasn't fully used it yet, but he's been able to, you know, control things. He's been able to control Titans and send them, um, which seems like they're doing now. Right. Because we've seen them be able to do a variation of that already. Um, we've seen. uh Annie do it we've seen uh you know all of them do it really to be able to to call so uh how or but not to the extent it seems like the way Aaron did it was to a different extent so what um I don't know like what what could you do more than that could you like because could you control them for like uh for an extended period of time or something like what would be added on because once he did that he was able to send them that way he he hasn't used it again since then end of season two like that ability has been like forgotten or something well what actually now that i think about it why has he not used this since then has that been addressed or did i did i miss that or like wouldn't you want to use that while he's here like he or maybe Aaron just doesn't know how to use it it was just like a one-time fluke and he doesn't know how to use it he just like it was just the way he was thinking at the time or something that's the only thing I can think of because why else wouldn't you use that why wouldn't you like strategize and say hey I'm going to um <laughs> I, I'm gonna send all these titans out and uh you know and and attack then they would never have to worry if Aaron had that type of control at all times um but obviously he doesn't or this whole issue I'm I'm surprised that wasn't addressed or even a strategy was thrown out I I'm trying to go back in my mind I don't think that was ever said again right not like not really talked about not the way but that first half of season three they weren't fighting titans they were fighting humans so I guess they hadn't needed it, but at the same time, why wouldn't you use it now? It's, ooh, I mean, they, they strategized and they focused on Aaron's hardening ability, right? Obviously, they worked on that part, um, uh, and they and they improved that, but why wouldn't they strategize to use that other ability um, to help them if they got in situations like this? Like... When I think about it, it just seems weird. Why? Like you have all that you know, just like you're you're utilizing Aaron as a tool. Yeah, you know, Erwin especially who th thinks a million steps ahead and is so bent on. I would. Su I'm surprised. I my only thought is he mu Aaron must not have been able to do it again. He must have like like not been able to use that ability again, and it was a fluke. And uh, or people didn't like realize that Aaron did it or something. I don't know. I mean, Casa, all of them saw him do something. So it's just surprising why that wouldn't be addressed again. Um, but in this case that I if somebody's like, you know, they have all those Titans there. Would he even be able to take control of them? That the ones that are already there? I don't know. Um, yeah, but this is a <laughs> this is always a bad situation, but it was nice to see Aaron and Reiner go at it again and it be really even. Also, did you guys notice the mat when that mask like uh you know his armor is like breaking and half his face is like that red, it looked like the red inside the wall, the the Titan inside the wall too, like that red mask thing. Um that's like I I, I didn't realize that it looked almost duplicate. It was it was weird. Um but anyway, guys, thank you for watching. Uh, make sure you subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Smash that like button. Uh, hit the notification bell. Go follow me on Twitter at AJRich123 as well as my Patreon at patreon.com slash AJRich123 for full reactions and early releases. And uh, seriously, thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.